what up YouTube, it's me, it's me, it's Private Stay, how you doing? This is my midweek sales update, hope you're all okay out there in eBay land. Um, yeah, these are the last two days worth of sales, not amazing, I think I am... Um, what all, all of this through is innuendos in my head, so I don't, I don't want to say, don't say certain things that are going on in my head. I think I kind of, um, there's nothing. I'll, I'll tell you what's oh, shot too early, came too early, um, just all rude stuff, you know what I mean now. So I think, um, you know, I've had my weekend of fantastic sales, but it's, it's not been that bad, it's not been terrible, there's a few, um, a lot of bits here, um, but nothing, nothing, nothing like, um, what it was like on the weekend but you know it's midweek it's midweek guys um after talking to like a few people at the meetup i was talking um talking about like um how many dispatch days they have on their stuff um i used to do like three day dispatch and then <clears throat> when i come on doing it kind of full time um I went to two day dispatch, just thought, you know, I'll do it Monday, Wednesday, Friday. But I, I am thinking about going back to like a three day dispatch kind of thing, um, just to make it easier on me, I've got to be honest. Uh, also, I had, there would have been another, um, like another wad of sales um, of jewellery again. I, I think I, met, I mentioned it in the last video, and I don't, I don't think it's a subscriber, subscribers don't normally purchase off me um but when we were in the pub on sunday i was talking about um of course i was getting a lot of kachings and there was just these offers of like 244 135 133 all these weird little offers um i decided to take up i think i think that there was they ended up being like 11 in total and the, they were just either they were at half price or just under half price and it's any little bitty shitty bits of jewelry so I like took them on, about 31 quid I think the order was, um, only costing me a fiver. So the person got in touch on Monday saying they wanted to, wanted some more. Um, and I said, well, if you know, if you do it now, I can pack it up with your order that I've already got. And, um, you know, it won't cost you any more, you know what I mean? Well, I won't charge you pounds did you get. So we went through the same process of I think it ended up being like 15 items, um, all with like little weird prices. And then I was getting like requests to cancel this. Can you cancel this one? Can you cancel that one? Can you cancel? And it's like you do realize you can just watch these. You might as well just purchase them. So she she like purchased about 15, cancelled, I think it was four of them. And I said to her, you need to pay like basically straight away so i can get it out or you've got like i said i'll give you 24 hours that was monday it's now wednesday and they still haven't been paid for it's just annoying because like spent like a good portion of my night on monday night just accepting accepting offers it was also a thing i think she might have got annoyed as well because she was then going on to my other items so she then was started to send offers on some vases. And I was like, okay, it's a bit different. It's a bit different like me me selling you like a little bracelet for £2.45 um, that was on for a fiver. And now it's adding up to you coming and half pricing like, a, I think it was like a 40 quid vase. And she come, I think she was trying to get it for like 16 quid. And I was like, nah. <laughs> um, but yeah, I don't know if she got annoyed with that because I just because then I messaged her going, look, I'll give you combined postage on the jewelry, but if you start like purchasing, like I think she sent like I think it was like three or four offers. These were ones that I declined or I went back with more money. Um, but I think it was like three different vases she thing it on and I was going, well I can't do, you've already purchased 11 items, then another 11 jewellery items, 
Now you're doing like three or four vases. So for God's sake. So um I'm going to do, I'm, I'm still waiting for payment on that other stuff. I'm going to be packing the rest of it up today. Um, but I'm just, I think I'm just going to, I don't think it's a sub subscriber, sorry if it is. But yeah, I'm just going to cancel the order and block it because I can't be dealing with that crap. Just weird. It's like, God. Just, it's like all night, like good like two hours of just going back and forth with our own messages and um offers just anyway so uh what we got first uh i'll show you these bits first i think so it's just a little bit out the loft we have a ben 10 figure the ben 10 figure his name's ultimate cannon bolt and i haven't even got to look it up because i already know so quite a few of him in my Oh, in my past. Oh, just had a freaking major point of freaking art there, man. I don't know where that's come from. Um, so yeah, Ben 10 Ultimate Cannonball. So I probably picked him up a car boot at some point. Cost a pair and went for three ninety nine. Um, we have these are all little bits to banging about for a while. Um, one of the things that I have started doing, um, you know, after speaking to to Lex was something she told me to do a long time ago. I think Carla mentioned has mentioned it to me before. Um, he's putting like a one percent promo on all of my listings, uh, so I've put a one percent promo on all my listings and kind of little old stuff is going that's been listed for a while, like that figure and this. Um, so yeah, this is DreamWorks Home. It's an alright film actually. Me and the daughter went to watch it when she was a little younger. Um, cost a pound went for three ninety nine. So. Nothing amazing. Then we have a little bit of jewellery. A Nicolas. Nicolas. Hang on there. Um, also, not that anybody's going to be particularly bothered. I don't think people are hanging on their um, hanging on the edge of the seats waiting for me to Larice, 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 release. I don't think people are hanging on the, the edge of the seats waiting for me to release a video. But um, I think next week, for probably for about two weeks now, I probably won't be putting any videos out because of um, the kids being off, or the kids and the wife being off. So it's a bit of a nightmare. I might pop one or two out, but that's what she said. Um, but yeah, I might do one or two, but I won't be doing them consistently. Um, I, what did I put for this? Silver Tone. Statement pearl style circle chain links necklace. See, necklace is all the way down the bottom and it's still sold. 87p, this cost me about £4.50. Uh, then we've got some badges. As I said, nothing, nothing like crazy this um, this time. In the past couple of days, I don't know if there's something going on with the RSPB or something, but I've sold. I think it's one, so four RSP badges in the past couple of days. Um, I showed you this one the other day, and I said I had another one. It sold literally after I said that statement. I think it sold while I was recording. So just an RSP Christmas Robin. Um, that went for four quid. Mm -mm -mm. We have a snowy owl. Well, be snowy owl. You can see his little fatty. There we go. Um, that went for four quid. I was watching, I don't really watch my videos back that much, but I, I was watching one the other day to kind of, I, was, I think I was trying to get a screenshot for the thumbnail, and I realised I don't look very attractive looking down like that when I'm like that, so I'm going to have to try and go. I'm saying I look attractive, yeah. RSB 
Golden Eagle. That went for four quid. Twelve quid there on little badges. Um, and then another one. RSPB Red Squirrel. That went for four quid. Is it going to be four quid again? Let's have a look now. It's three pound fifty for a gold tone camel. <laughs> yeah. So what's that? Four, eight, twelve, sixteen. Yeah, let's round it off to twenty on three pound fifty. So yeah, twenty quid on badges. Um, we've got a pair of hotters. A pair of hotters. Pair of otters that cost me seven ninety nine. They're tone ones. Uh, they went for twenty two ninety nine. We have a merino wool. Is it merino wool or is it cashmere blend? I think it's cashmere blend. I don't know why I said merino wool. I know why I've got heartburn. I'll just have a look at some marks. I'll base pasta thing for lunch. That's why I've got heartburn. Um, yeah, a uh, white stuff saddle knit cashmere blend um, jumper that cost me three forty nine. Ah, that went for twenty seven quid. Ow, went for twenty seven quid. And the last one, this one went on auction um, last night. Only the one bid, but I put it on for nineteen ninety nine. I started the auction off. At nineteen ninety nine, it cost me one ninety nine, and it sold for nineteen ninety nine on auction. Um, Columbia twenty eighteen Adidas away shirt. Um, this was the one I was telling you about. One of the workers in one of the charity shops was. Kind of, I think she was trying to convince me to not purchase it so she could have it, and I was like, "You can do one." <laughs> so yeah, so yeah. That's my midweek sales. I think the midweek ones there's never gonna be they're never gonna be spectacular, are they? Um But yeah, I'm sorry. I'm up, I'm doing well after the start of this month. I, I am taking into account although the start of this month has been really good, I'm not expecting it to be consistently all the way through the month soon as you know. Christmas comes. I do have sales on Christmas Day, but during the Christmas period it kind of dies off, don't it? But anyway, for now, peace out, stay safe, stay beautiful, and I will see you in my next video.